And welcome back, friends. This is Undertale 2017. Woohoo! Um, let's carry on. Uh, there's a ghost on this carpet. And it's snoring. Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud, repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Um... Oh, did I just... Nah, a stab look. Okay. Doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. Oh, I'm real funny. Oh, he's crying onto the feet. Oh my god. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I cheer him up? Give him look a patient smile. Heh. Really not feeling up to it right now. I'm sorry. Looks just a little bit better. You told Napstab look a little joke. So he's, he's trying not to laugh at my jokes. Cheering seems to have improved Napstab's mood again. Can I spare him? Just plugging along. It's obviously he's. Am I supposed to just make him in a good mood? He wants to show you something. Let me try. Alright, show me then. <laughs> Cheer. Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Hey, I solved it with non-violence. Did you miss it? Spider bake sale going... Spider bake sale down to the right. Come, come eat food made by spiders for spiders of spiders. Oh my god, that's... Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Is this a shop? Leave seven gold in the web. No. Leave 18 gold in the web. No. I'm not gonna give money to spiders. Uh, rip it, rip it, sigh. My friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk, they skip to my words by pressing X. That's right, pressing X. Or A in my case. Well, at least you listen to me. I heard using F4 can make you have a full screen. But what does F4 stand for? Four frogs? I have only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling, to say the least. Ugh. I've heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely, you know by now, a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. Well, I actually didn't know that, but I do know that. What do you think of that? Uh, that's helpful, thank you. It is rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day, you'll have to do it even if their name isn't yellow. Hmm. Hello. I just realized that it's been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Alright, so limited inventory system then. Is it? There is just one switch.
Um, how am I supposed to find out where the switch is? Okay, so the mold small is... The mold... I can spare the mold small. Swing your arms, baby. Oh, he's just dancing. Oh, he's just dancing. Oh, I'm not gonna bother you then. That's not a switch. Oh, there was a switch. I think I just locked out. That's pretty cool. Didn't I see something in the other crawl spaces here that I fell down in? I think I saw a carrot in this one. Yeah. Oh shit, what's this? Vegetoid came out of the earth. Jake, Vegetoid attack six, serving size one monster, not monitored by the USDA. <laughs> Part of a complete breakfast. <laughs> okay. Vegetoid cackles softly. It doesn't seem nice, so I'm gonna smack him in the face a bit. Fresh morning taste. Ah! Stop! Stop! It smells like steamed carrots and peas. Part of a complete breakfast! Are these carrots or what are they? I'm not sure. Vegetoid gave a mysterious smile. I'm gonna just... Just smack him in the face. This game is making it very hard to find reasons to uh, to, uh, to to slap things. I mean, I could spare him now, but your love increased. Oh yeah, level. Hooray! See, here's the thing. I'm I'm beating up just nice things at least so far. I mean, both of these things. One of them is just a blob. And he's just dancing. Look at him go! Look at him go! He doesn't have a care in the world, so I'm just gonna let him run off. But then again, I guess that's the point of the game. It's a switch. Press it. Sure, nothing happened. Okay. The far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation in perspective. What? Okay. It's a switch, press it. Yes, nothing happened. Eh. Swing your arms. Oops. It's a switch, press it. Nothing happened. So the, f the this just marks a shift in perspective. So this is the same room. Right, you know what? I'm gonna Oh wow, he suddenly went insane. Legion, we are Legion. Did he just turn into an anonymous or something? <laughs> Nothing like alone time. Oh he just wants to be alone. So he's gonna be mad until someone leaves. Doesn't have a care in the world. Well I need experience, I'm sorry. La la, just be yourself. Uh, why am I beating this guy up? He just wants to be alone. Being me is the best. Uh, refuses to give up. Now he's just dancing. And I'm a horrible person. Oh, whatever. God damn it. Right, shift in perspective, shift in perspectivo. Damn it! What the hell is going on here? You notice there was a blue switch behind the top pillar. Oh, thank you. It's a switch, press it, yes. You heard a clicking sound. Alright, because the shift in perspective. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, a pair of Lukes decided to pick on you. No, fuck off. You're not picking on me. I'm gonna slap your faces in. 
Please don't pick on me. Smells like eye drops. Ah! Damn it. I wonder if I have a way to heal myself. I've got my eye on you. Oh, she uh, is gazing at you. Got my eye on you. Oh my god, I'm almost dead. Please stop having your eye on me. Please stop, please stop too. Alright, so he's watering up. That's because I'm... You won! You earn 14 XP and 10 gold, your love is increased. Do I have... We weapon, stick, armor, bandage. Now say hello about yourself. Call her mom. Flirt. Right, let's call her and say hello. This is Toriel. You only wanted to say hello. Well then. Hello! I hope that suffices. Hey, hey. Okay. And she's gonna be mad when she figures out that I've killed a bunch of people. If you can read this, press the red switch. Alright. It's the switch. Alright. Um can I spare any of these? No, I cannot. Oh, devour. No! No! That's it? Can't give up just yet. Pukey! Stay determined. Alright, I am staying determined. But of course you're gonna send me back here. It's stuck to the table. What about... Okay, I don't know the song yet, but... Oh, let's save. Oh my god, that's a... Uh... Crap, I almost lost the entire... Um, all of my progress for today. Alright, so... Um... Alright, you don't need to see all this stuff again, so I'm just gonna, you know... I'll see you guys shortly. Alright, we're back. I just kind of forgot for a second where we were, where we were at, but we were at this switch room, if I don't remember wrong. And I managed to get around here to an extent. Um, that blue switch it makes me fall down. If you can read this, press the green switch. Well, which one is the green one? Uh, sure. I guess this is the green switch then. Oh, battle time! Couple of vegetoids. These guys, they offer um, offer one green of their in their attack patterns. One of them is going to be green if you ask them for dinner. And vegetoids are here for my health. Contains vitamin A, so they are literally vegetables, and they know it. What's good about it? What happens if I devour? Let me try. You tried to eat Vegetoid, but it wasn't weakened enough. Okay, sure. Um, that's a bit weird. Uh, let's smack him around a bit. Farmed locally, very locally. I'm sure you are. Ah! Cackles softly. Can I devour him now? Ah, uh, gotta hit him one more time, I guess. Fresh morning taste! I just, I can't help but... It, it... 
I just wish he was the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes guy. Oh, Kellogg's? Is it Kellogg's? No, I'm not sure if it's Kellogg's. I don't remember. I think it's been like... I don't know how long it's been since I last ate. You took a bite out of Vegetoid. You received 5 HP. Oh, awesome. Alright, so you can smack people around without being a nasty person. Uh, so far, this game has taught me not to step in grass. Well, I think I'm expecting too much. Oh, oh dear. That took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There, there. I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try and surprise you like this. Uh... Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Alright, save point. Glorious save point. Seeing such a cute, tidy house, house in the ruins gives you determination. So, I get determination every time I step in a safe spot. I get it! Do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on a snail... What? On snail pie for tonight. Ugh. Here, I have another surprise for you. You do? I'm gonna check your stuff first. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. Wow, the music is really good in this game. You see such a... And I, my apologies to the developer if, if if this isn't intended, but you see such a on the outset uh, ugly looking game. You never expect such good music. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Aw, and she's stroking. Well, this is obviously intended the graphics. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Okay, so this is my house now. You've seen this type of plant before, but don't know its name. Aww. Look at these cool toys! They don't interest you at all. Okay. How old is this kid? An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. Oh. Oh, I can change the music. Box of kids' shoes in, dis in a disparity of sizes. Alright, let's hop into bed. And you found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Awesome. So I have that now. Can you get some info on it? Butterscotch pie, all HP. Butterscotch cinnamon pie, one slice. Right, turn on your lights before you go out. No, actually, keep them off. Save energy! Alright, this is uh, quite a nice house. What's this? Storia's diary. Read the circle passage? No, don't read other people's diary. It's an encyclopedia of certain subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods. No more commonly as water sausages. Well, that's interesting. Inside the drawer are some are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Room under renovations. So, I guess this cow person is expecting more more things to come down here. Let's check out the rest of this house. It's got this it's got this ugly aesthetic to it, but it's really charming in a way. But then again, I love retro games, so it's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind a barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This is our new home, which we named Home, well, obviously. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. Hmm. Up already, I see. Um, I want, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I have also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. 
Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? What? This this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? How to exit the rooms. Um, how about an exciting snail fight? Did you know that snails talk really slowly? Just kidding. Snails don't talk. Interesting. How to exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. Well, she's very nice and all, but uh, I don't think I'm supposed to just end the game by staying in this house forever. Oh, there's the rest of the pie. Can I get some more pie? The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Oh, what's the flame? Did you go downstairs, maybe? Wouldn't it be funny if I went downstairs and she has like a satanic ritual or something down here? Oh god, I'm gonna be right, aren't I? You wish to, to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No, fuck off. Don't don't destroy it. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they... Asgore will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. No, I'm not going to go to my room. I want an adventure. I don't want to live in my room for the rest of time. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Oh man, she's getting mad. You want to leave so badly? Hmm. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me that you are strong enough to survive. Oh, she's gonna be mad. Toria blocks the wire away. Let's talk. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Oh, holy crap. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Toriel prepares a magic attack. He tried to think of something to say again, but... So, Toriel is mad because I want to leave. Toriel prepares magic attack. Uh, come on. Ironically, talking doesn't seem to be the solution to this situation. That's not ironically, she's been telling me to be nice all along. Damn it! Alright, so let me smack you then. Oh, she has a lot of HP. Ah! Oh, crap. Uh... Knows best for you, okay. No, you don't. You're killing me! Wait. Is she unable to kill me? I, I assume it's a she. Uh... Yeah, she won't kill me. Also, my attacks are getting... are very strong against this one. Alright, so she won't ever kill me. See, I'm strong, Torio. Screw you. Yeah, talking doesn't seem to be the solution here. That's interesting.
Whoa! Ugh. You are stronger than I thought. Listen to me, small one. If you go beyond this door, keep walking as far as you can. Eventually, you will reach an exit. Asgore, do not let Asgore take your soul. His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. Be good, won't you, my child? Ah, oh, I feel so bad about this. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God. But that is horrifying. Oh, God. Uh, she did say to just keep walking, though. Ah, oh, not this flower asshole again. <laughs> I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fates. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That old hag thought she could break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans. But when it came down to it, <laughs> she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. I really don't like that flower. All right, so here we are. Oh, that was just the intro. Hi, Toby Fox. You've made a made an interesting game so far. All right, here we are. So, ruins gives way to scary, scary forest. Uh, if I step on that, I, I feel it feels like something is following me. I think I'm going to eat my butterscotch pie right now. Oh, man, that's... Very creepy. Oh, this is very creepy. Uh, human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the can trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know... I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Yeah, convenient. <laughs> Sup, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this old lamp. It's really cool. You wanna look? No! 
I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want, want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly desire. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sons, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and bond doggle, boon doggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> oh my god. Sons! Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. <sighs> Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. Ugh. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, you can come out now. Wow, this, this guy. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Yeah. I, but I want to. <laughs> What's the hole up? Look, there's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a dark cavern filled with skeletons and horrible monsters. It's uh, some sort of checkpoint or a sentry station. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Well, that's because it's a hot dog stand, you dummy. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. Okie doke. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Well, that's pretty random. But I guess um, this episode has gone on too long. Too far in between save points and also existential horror and dread. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it an episode here. And uh, check back next video for more Undertale funsies. Um, my first playthrough ever. Spoiler free even. Uh, so yeah. Thanks for watching. See you guys. Enjoy. Enjoy.